Welcome back to Harmony. On today's episode, we have quite a lot of building to do. I have so many ideas. What, I thought I just saw Enderman over there. No, okay. Welcome back to Harmony. So on today's episode, we have a lot to do. I have so many ideas that I wanna build over here. There he is, I knew I was not going crazy. Okay, so we have a lot to do today. So I have a few villager houses I wanna build as well as a barn, which I got the inspiration from and I will leave the link down below, but we have a lot we wanna do today. But before we hop into this, um, we had a friend, Nova, request to fight the wither. So let me just give you guys a clip of how that went. Hey. God, not us being in another world. <laughs> Hey, um, you know, by, by chance, do you have any food? I'm, I'm on one heart here. Um, I'm kind of struggling. Okay. I just I, want a beacon, you know. Oh my God. I have you. some bread. Do you want some apples as well? Oh my gosh. Thank <laughs> you. You took the pack lunch seriously. You said come back with lunch. <laughs> so I'm here getting a wither school. Um, I, I don't know if you can tell, you know, it, it's, it's not that noticeable. Um, I am turning a bit green, um, you know, you look just, green. Uh, on the I didn't want to say anything, but okay. uh, I need a second person to say that. <laughs> um, but I had, I had the brilliant idea, right? Okay. If my base is really outlandish, you know, out of this world, really stands out from everyone else's, okay. then nobody's going to be paying attention to the color of my skin and my ears and my antenna. They'll be paying attention to the big beacon in the sky, right? So by comparison, I am all, and then everything else around me is going to look really <laughs> insane. And I don't know. It's pretty hard to miss, but I mean, good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, who is shooting at me? Have you also got a, a weird like area that, or, and like a bunch of dirt in, in your house? I, I did. And my house was filthy. Uh, and I'm an alien who likes to pride himself in having a very clean, you know, very modern, very open space house. So it just really just got on my nerves. Yeah, that was kind of weird. Well, I could use some blaze rods as well. <gasps> oh, I have four if you want them. There you go. Ooh, thank you. And, and, what? Uh, oh, it's a hole right here. No. This is not the vibe. <gasps> oh. Where did he just go? Oh, okay. That's lava. Never there you mind. Go. Oh my God, thank you. I thought I saw- Do you hear one? I thought I heard Oh, it's down here. Oh. Oh my God, there's some, there's multiple. Oh wait, there's a whole other other section we haven't even gone to yet. Across this So how way? have you been? <laughs> um, building and trying to figure out what's going on. This thing again. You lucky I don't have my bow. They are quite aggressive. There it is. Have you ever seen an alien before? Um, I think I'm looking at one right now, but I'm not sure. I don't even know if I am an alien. You know, like my ears grew really long and it hurt, I'll tell you. You know when you're like growing up and your ankle hurts because you're like getting taller or whatever? Like yeah. literally, it hurt like that and I was so confused. And then earlier today, oh, ooh, hey. <laughs> I am jumping me. <laughs> oh my God. The strangest thing happened today. I was dyeing my sheep green. I touched one of my sheep and it was invisible. What? Like my baby sheep was invisible. He was eating grass, invisible, moving around. And I was so confused. So I, I held out wheat to him. And sorry, I'm like, <laughs> there's a lot going on in my body right now. Yeah. And, um, I held out wheat to him and he ate it, but he was invisible when he ate it. So I was feeding an invisible sheep that I didn't even know it was there. That sounds then, extremely strange. As he ate it, my whole body started to tingle. And then I looked at myself and I had these big ass eyes. <laughs> oh my God. 
Uh, I just can't catch a break, and there's no skeleton. I don't know. I feel like there's something. Do you want a, another star, by the way? We could fight two withers. I mean, we could. That's true. If we you can find. Uh, <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, there you are. I don't want to jump off of here and die. Hold on. One thing about me is I'm going to jump literally everywhere. <laughs> How rare is the skeleton head drop? With Ludian 3, it shouldn't be that rare. I raided your shop. No shade. I took everything. No! <laughs> Wait, you paid, right? Of course. Oh, okay. Just make sure. That's why I'm broke. This <laughs> scared the hell out of me. <laughs> oh, I see one. Oh, I can't get across here. Move, I don't want to hit you. Oh, I see some over there. Where? All the way over there. Right in front of you to the- well, I'm <gasps> Oh my God, I got one. <gasps> no way. Okay, that's two. We just need one more. Well, I guess if we're fighting two, we need a lot more. I think. Can you guys like leave? I don't want to accidentally yeah, hit no you. Way. Oh, I spotted some. Right there. Where? You see him? I'm looking no. right at it. <gasps> oh, hi. <laughs> Be careful, it's lava. I know parkour. <laughs> oh, one of them just spawned. So selfish. Right? Just drop your head. Doesn't it? It's <laughs> not like you need it. <laughs> this whole mission being completely selfish to me because I'm. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I need some practice, so. What do you. What's, what's your sword in here? What, what do I have on it? Yeah. Uh, sweeping edge, sharpness, relax. Oh my God, I have like 22 blaze rods. <gasps> what the hell was this? What was that? No. Oh, well I went in to like try to investigate, but I haven't seen that before. It's a hellhound. Oh my gosh. I don't know what that is, but it looks crazy. Oh, the big squid in the sky? Yes. Oh my god. Oh, they're they're pretty harmless. You know, you should take one as a pet, but don't touch him or ever get close to him or even think about like putting a finger on him. Oh. Like <gasps> Oh, he's gone. I know. <laughs> Despawn. No. I wanted one. Well, mm, they explode. Oh, okay. Pretty friendly. Never mind. So that's coming up. They're all going for you. I got it. I got it. I got it. Leave. Now what the hell did I do? I have all three. I have, that was so fast. Wait. Okay. Let's see now we gotta find some down here. Sand. Oh, I forgot Wait, okay. you need soul sand. So, um, I have some good news. What is it? Did you find it? No, but I found two more wither skeleton skulls. So we just need one more. How did you find two? <laughs> I killed some withers. Oh gosh. I was trying to see, cause the biomes here are so random. You know, it's hard to see with all the fog too. Right. Really? A little. Die. Die. Thank you. You for a second, and then you came back into earshot, and all I hear is die, die. I'm, like, oh. <laughs> I'm trying to kill these little red thingy. Wait, I don't even know where you're at. <laughs> I'm right above you. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, I almost slapped you. Honestly, okay. maybe like another good group of scouts. I have two withers. The only thing is, is um, I'm not prepared at all. I only have what's on me. This sword and a bow and the oh bread that gosh. you gave me. I have no potions. Um, oh, and my head doesn't fit into helmets anymore. So, well, you know, I don't. I, I mean, it helmet, looks so. like it can't, to be honest. What the hell? <laughs> I'm just pointing out the obvious. How did you hear that? My hearing is so bad. My sound is all the way up. I thought it was because Wait. of the ears. Okay, enough with the ear jokes. <laughs> this is crazy. 
<laughs> Hold on, I see some. Oh my God, it's so many over there. <laughs> Sir, please. We just need one more school. Here, you take two of these. I went into here thinking I was going to fight one with it today. This is going to be fun. <gasps> yes! No way. Let's go find some soul sand somewhere. Okay, where are we? Have uh, there's my house. Oh, you want to fight at your house? No, no, no. I'm going to take this to the place, but I want to show you what I have beforehand. Okay. Okay, so with me, I brought four gapples, um, four buckets of water. I have some ender pearls, some steak, and my lucky puffer fish. What oh, do you have? Okay, um, I have this for you, oh. this for you. Oh my God. And I have some golden apples and a bow. You know, well, one of us putting more work into the other, but it's fine. Okay, let's go. One of us has to make it out alive, okay? Okay, so right. I was snooping underground one day, and I found these really, really long mine shafts that go way under the ground. And it's far enough away from my house that I'm hoping we can fight the wither and it'll be okay. Well, I guess okay. two withers. Nice over here. That's your house, you said? Yeah, that's my whole area. I plan to expand more, but that's it for right now. It kind of looks like a ship. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, okay. Ooh, snake! No! They don't hit you. They don't hit you. Oh, I never okay, got close enough to find out. <laughs> the green ones especially are really nice. To me, anyway. I wonder oh, what, why. What if they think I'm like a big version of them? This is sad. <laughs> I mean... This is the worst <laughs> week of my life. Like... My skin is turning green. My eyes are all like puffy and big. I just turned 22. I'm basically 30. Like <laughs> it's really just all, all getting to me. I mean, I don't know if you've heard of Yoda. Okay. So anyway, this is the place here. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I have one of these by my house. Yeah, it goes really Woo. far down. So uh... let's go. Are you just jumping? This is a far away now. Hi, I'm here. <laughs> hey. Okay, let's let's do it in the far back or something. There we go. Okay, are you ready? I'm scared. I mean, it's closed off, so we should be good unless they start doing some. Well, we need a place to run, so we just run back. We're good. Okay. 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 We can One, do it. Two, three. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You have to wait for it to load. Don't wait, be angry. It it's loading up. Loading? <laughs> yes, it's crazy. There it goes. Oh my God. Is it ready? Yes, shoot it. Oh no, it seems angry. It seems angry. It seems <laughs> It was just a joke, yeah, a small joke. Relax, it was just a joke. He does not like me. Oh my God. We did it. Did it drop the star? Oh, oh it did. Yay. Oh Got a heart attack. Yeah. Okay, so we just got one more. Alrighty, hold on. Let me heal up. We didn't even use our potions. See, we got this. We, I did. Oh, you did? <laughs> okay. Okay, let me use mine. All right, you ready? Oh my god. Why is this? <laughs> it's loading because it's angry. You have to wait for it to load. Oh, right, right. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it came straight for me. I'm stuck in a cobweb. Sword. Oh, he is angry. <gasps> Yay! I got it. <laughs> Yay, I can have a beacon. Yes, it's over here. My is this way? It's so nice. Are you okay? Are you talking to outer space right now? <sighs> what the hell? Did he kill the withers? Yes. Are you okay? Out here? No, we just did it underground. It doesn't look like underground to me. <laughs> we just came from underground. Are you okay? Um. Okay. 
if you say so. Oh, I have another star. I'm so excited about my beacon. Well, anyway, that's how I ended up with this blaze rods in another star. But I don't know. I think our friend Nova is in denial. It's given alien. So I, I don't know what we're going to do about that situation because me being a monster hunter does nova fall under that category should i continue to befriend him i don't know we have to figure that out they can't be bad right they just seem a little confused but we do have a lot to do in this area in with building so let's try to focus on that while we kind of just figure out what's going on here because this is all just so crazy but yeah let's go ahead and hop into it okay so we have healed up our tools so what I want to do is actually make the beacon that we got. Well, the nether star and tula beacon, but I don't have any obsidian. I believe it's a ruined portal somewhere over here. So let's go check. Ah, uh, here we go. So let's go ahead and steal some of this obsidian to make our beacon. Okay, I think that is enough obsidian. So let's get back to our house and make this beacon actually you know what we should grab some iron while we're at it because obviously it's gonna be made out of iron because i do not have enough diamonds to waste on a beacon right now so let's go grab some iron first actually all right let's grab some iron oh we're almost full okay there should be plenty of iron to make i'm not really sure what's the structure of a beacon to be honest i'll have to look that up but at least we have enough so let's see how many blocks we can make out of this okay, i think i figured out how to do this so let's see we're gonna do it here temporarily so i think it needs to be a nine by nine on the bottom layer so All right, and the second layer needs to be a seven by seven, so. All right, and the next layer needs to be a five by five. All right, and the last one should be a three by three. Okay, now let's see if this works. And do I have to do anything? There we go, yeah, we have a beacon, which I'm probably gonna move eventually. Okay, so I think I figured it out. So now we have speed and haste. Uh, that was extremely complicated uh, for someone who has never used a beacon before. Uh, but yeah, I'm not sure on the range, but I just wanted to set up the beacon because it's cool. And we, we achieved that by fighting the wither. So the next thing on our list is actually going to be collecting some clay because we need bricks for this build that we're gonna work on, which is a barn. And I actually got the idea, well, the literal idea and tutorial from Zaypixel. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but they just released a video and I fell in love with the barn. Like I was trying to figure out ideas for the barn and I was like, this is perfect. You know, we might as well use this and just change it up a bit. So we're actually gonna put it up here. So we have been doing a lot of terraforming. So we're gonna have the barn over here and then we're gonna have our farm animals over here. And just, this is gonna be the farm space. We've also done some terraforming um, over this way. So we have plenty of safe space and you see I've already mapped out some areas that we're gonna use to just expand this village area. So, but let's go ahead and start collecting some clay for the brick. Okay, so we have plenty of clay down here. So let's just collect some. God, I swear collecting clay is so satisfying. Okay, so we have filled up our inventory with clay. So let's head back up and start smelting all of this because we're going to need it. So let's go. Okay, so smelting brick is taking quite some time. So we're gonna do just a little montage of me collecting all the supplies I'm gonna need for this barn. So let's hop into it. Okay, so that took about an hour. 
uh, partly due to my poor organization, but we're not gonna talk about that. But we have everything we need for this build. So once again, I'm gonna leave down below where I got this design idea from so you guys can check it out. So let's go ahead and hop into this build. It took so long to collect the materials. I just can't wait till it's done because I absolutely love it. So let's go ahead and hop into it. Okay, we are finally done. This took so long, well, including the um, bringing the animals over here, but they're here. We have the chickens, we have sheep, and we have cows. I'm not really sure if I want pigs or not because I don't really use them for anything, but we might add a couple here just for aesthetics. So we do have uh, the animals out here, but we do have some in here because you know when we need them they're not roaming around and i don't have to chase after them i have no idea how he got in here what how did you get in here oh i wonder if it's because of the barrel let's just put this right here just in case okay really weird anyway this is the inside of the barn and then we have a little area where we can smelt and have a small storage with these beautiful flowers and of course we have the little plants up here so we can have the particle effect, which I love, in our little um, crates. And if we hit upstairs, we just have areas over here with random things you might see in a barn. I'm going to add a bed up here just in case because, you know, when you're running around and you want to find a place to sleep, this would be a cool place, you know just to hang around again i got this design from zay pixels and i'm gonna leave their information down below i just changed up the blocks and some of uh, the outside just just a tad bit but yeah basically the design is from there and i absolutely fell in love with it so i had to recreate it on my uh world in harmony so uh, I think we don't really have anything else I want to accomplish in this episode. I do uh, want to build a couple villager houses. I've already, like I said, made some area 
over here and then over there as well. So we're probably gonna work on that in the next episode because we have so many that we wanna build. I think maybe four houses that we're gonna build, but I have to get the designs. I think I'm just gonna stick with the regular uh, villager designs that we use and just make them, like I said, our style for Black Crystal, so yeah. Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode off right here. Let me know what you guys think about the new barn we built over there as well as our beacon. Like, I'm super proud. We fought two withers with the help of Nova. Um, also, it was kind of weird. Nova told me that he also had the dirt in his house with the little sign. So maybe we can try to figure out a little more about that in the next episode, because we're still not sure who left that there. So maybe we can figure out, like I said, more about that. So let's go ahead and get on out of here. Before we do though, be sure to like and subscribe as it's 100% free and it really helps the channel out. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye friends.